Quarantine Kitchen. My name is Karen and I'm here today to bring you some of my favorite snacks and treats to make at home. On today's show, we are going to be focusing on desserts. Now in the past couple of shows, we've done healthy snacks and things you can have before dinner, but today we're gonna to be thinking about things you're gonna eat after dinner. What do you guys think of when you think of desserts? I think of chocolate and maybe some fruit and all things delicious. So today I'm gonna to bring you two easy desserts that you guys can make at home. Our first dessert today is slices of banana dipped in chocolate. These are so easy to make and are so, so yummy as well. All you're gonna need is a banana, something to cut the banana with, and some melted chocolate. So it's such a short list of ingredients for this one, it's so easy to put together. To melt the chocolate, you're going to either need to melt it in the microwave or over a pot of hot water in a bowl. Now make sure to get an adult to help you with that bit. So after you've melted the chocolate, you're going to cut up the banana into chunks. Then you're going to need to get a tray and pop some greaseproof paper on top. And now we're ready to dip our banana into our chocolate and lay it on our tray. The best way to dip the bananas into the chocolate is to use a fork. So you wanna stick the fork into the top of the banana and just pop it in the chocolate. And then you just need to like toss it about a bit to get it fully covered. They are already looking so good. I'm just gonna go finish off the rest and then show you when I'm done. I'm gonna pop these in the fridge for about 15 minutes to let them harden. I'll have a look at them when they're ready. So our 15 minutes is up on our chocolate bananas and they are looking so good. I'm just gonna pop them on a plate now and show you guys. So that is these done. These are so, so quick and easy to make and they're really, really delicious as well. The perfect little treat for after dinner. So for our next quick and easy dessert today, we are going to be making Rice Krispie buns. These are so, so easy. I'm sure lots of you have made them before, but you just can't go wrong with them. They're so yummy. All you're gonna need for this dessert is some melted chocolate and some Rice Krispies. And again, for the melting of the chocolate, you can either do it in the microwave or in a bowl above a pot of hot water. And make sure you ask an adult to help you with that bit. Now, this next bit is so, so easy. You're just gonna wanna pour your Rice Krispies into your chocolate and then give them a mix. Right, so now that you've got them all mixed in, it's gonna look like this, lovely and chocolatey. Make sure when you're mixing not to go too hard because you don't wanna actually crush the Rice Krispies. Now, the next step is to pop the Rice Krispie mixture into your little bun cases. Now that is them done, you can pop them in the fridge as is for about half an hour, but I am not done with them just yet. I have an extra little flourish that I'm gonna add to make them look even more delicious. I'm now going to add some sprinkles on top of my Rice Krispie buns. Wow, don't these look brilliant? I'm so excited to eat them, but first they need to go into the fridge for about half an hour. So our half an hour is finished on our Rice Krispie buns. They're nice and hard now and ready to eat. These are so, so yummy and they look fantastic as well. So much fun to make. So that is it for me today, you guys. I hope you enjoyed me making these really yummy desserts. I think you should definitely give them a go at home because they are so easy to make and I'm sure the whole family would love them.